What's up, friends? Far and wide across expanse of the earth. My name is Miss Click, and do you see the title of this trailer? Oh my god, I'm so excited. <sighs> if you watch my other reaction videos, you know I've been wanting to hopefully see something from Robbie and from Pira. Mainly Pira. Robbie, I didn't think we were actually probably going to get to see much of, so I'm very excited. It's literally only 43 seconds long, so I know we'll go ahead and, and dive into this and, and get going. Um, I'm basically nocturnal now, so I'm about to go to the gym at like 9 p.m. and I'm watching the trailer. I don't know how long it's been out. I think it said seven hours ago, so... Yo, girl. Listen, life... Life is just crazy. Anyways, I'm gonna shut up. Let's watch it. <sighs> Are they playable? They're playable, right? It's a Hyrule Warriors game, so they have to be playable, yes? Maybe they maybe they aren't. Maybe they are. I hope they are. Oh my god. I will remind you once again. New cutscene. Above all else, your duty is Poor of Zelda. the utmost importance. Poor Zelda. Whoa! Look at him! He's so oh, dark! One of the researcher's code is to never give up. Oh, yeah! There she is! Yes. <laughs> There's something with her! It won't be easy. And the music! We're not gonna let that stop us, eh? Oh my god, look at them! Oh, but are they playable, though? Wait, hold on! Wait, I gotta watch this again! Hold on! I'll mute it this time. Okay, so we get to see the new cutscene. Um, it's crazy you get to see more from, like, the throne room, I guess. Poor Zelda, you see more pressure on her. Impa! So far? I mean, I guess we've seen her obviously talk more in the little bit that we have than Link. Like, Link never talks. I feel like Impa's been very quiet in everything that we've seen of her. Like, I feel like she's very much like Link. Like, doesn't talk a lot. It's kind of just there. I could be completely wrong, and I hope I'm wrong, because I would love Impa to, like, have some interaction and dialogue and stuff like that. Um, freaking Robbie, and now we see the baby guardian, so I'd assume, I would assume maybe we take it to him and he observes it. Dude, Robbie looks great. He looks like he's going to be quirky, very, very anime, uh, comic relief character, I feel like. Uh, there's usually... I don't know. It's always good to have comic relief. I'm very excited to see him. He looks great, though, getting to see the, the male Sheikah uh, variation of their kind of uniforms. I wonder what his backpack is, though. Like... So they are assisting, okay? It's exactly what I was uh, talking about, and probably not this... Maybe it was the past video? Maybe it was when I was watching gameplay. I had recorded watching gameplay at the, the game show, uh, the Tokyo... Um, and I, I was talking about, I didn't upload it because it was like 50 minutes of just gameplay, but I was talking about maybe we get to see Robbie and, and Pira helping the Hylian guard with kind of discovering and working on, you know, the the guardians and stuff and kind of, you know, like we saw the Sheikah helping them excavate the guardians. And um, it seems like now, obviously, they it looks like they're on at Hyrule Castle or is it the Citadel? Maybe that's the Citadel. <gasps> Is that the Citadel? It's very tall. I think that's the Citadel. So I guess they are like they are featured in the Akali lab. So it makes sense that they're at the Akali Citadel. Maybe that's where they were kind of stationed. So I think that's cool that maybe they're kind of helping prepare for the defenses and then it ultimately falls. So uh, that's crazy, man. Um, get to see more night interaction. His his freaking mask is so cool. And then freaking Pura. Like, come on, dude. She just like this. <clears throat> so he's like, snap! Yeah, she's she's look at them, dude. They're literally they're a tag team. It is the cutest thing ever. <sighs> Man, I wonder how awkward that must have been when she got freaking turned into a kid and Robbie's like, I want to snap her, I wanna be a kid again too. Oh boy. It's so cool seeing her young style. Obviously, it doesn't vary um, too incredibly much from her concept art, if you had seen the concept art books. But she looks great. And she's, she, obviously, she's got her glasses and everything, but she definitely has, I feel like, the exact personality that she needs to. Um, Impa looks so worried here. 
I mean, granted, Pira is the older sister, so I guess that makes sense. I just want to hear her voice lines one more time. Searcher's code is to never give up. Oh yeah! Check it! <laughs> Impa, I feel like this is going to be such a different Impa than we're used to seeing. Like, she always looks, she looks like how Zelda normally acts. I mean, I feel like in, in this specific frame, like, Impa looks more worried than Zelda does. I guess Zelda's very inquisitive in this specific iteration of her incarnation, but poor Impa just looks so worried all the time. I wonder if she's gonna, like, because Pyrrha's got all, like, the, the confidence and stuff, like, maybe, maybe Impa is just, like, the worried younger sister. I don't know. Maybe we get to see a development all on our own. It won't be easy, but we're not... Like... <sighs> gonna let that stop us, eh? Cute. I don't know. I'm excited. God, November 20th, dude. It's still so far away! I still... I still... Nah! It's still not enough! I need... I need it sooner. I'm kidding. It's actually not that far away. I'm glad they tease games, like, pretty much right. Right as they're about to come out. Tack's yelling. Tack, are you okay, bud? Anyways, um, I mean, they look great. I'm glad that they didn't show too much, though, because if they'd shown too much, in my opinion, I, like, you you wouldn't get to see, like, the really great moments. So I do, I do like the fact that the things that they show are very, like, snippets here and there. Uh, the music sounds great. Obviously, the, the lab theme, um... It looks like they're going to be stationed at Citadel. Are they playable, though? I would like to think so. Hyrule Warriors, you can have some of the most obscure characters have gameplay. If you can make Agatha have giant beetles and butterflies come out of the sky in, in Hyrule Warriors, you can definitely have some tech flying around uh, from Pyrrha and Robbie. So I would like to think so. Um, so here's, here's the fingers crossed. I'm just glad they're in the game in general, though. Like, that is... That is awesome to me, and I'm so excited because you just don't get to see flashbacks with them in Breath of the Wild. So I, I do like the fact that with Breath of the Wild <clears throat> itself, we get glimpses. We don't get the full picture. Looking back, I've always said I've wanted more story here and there. I feel like it was very skeleton. Like, like they want you to be able to go anywhere you want at any time, but it's very skeleton-based. But that makes so much sense now, because now that they have Hyrule Warriors, Age of Calamity, and then Breath of the Wild 2, pending if there's a different name, that kind of is filling in the meat and, and you know, like, the cartilage and the muscle and the tendons. It's, like, in the, the epidermis. It's, it's, it's filling it all in. You know what I mean? And I'm very excited to see what they have planned out, because from the sounds of it, you know, they've had each game allotted have their own respective details and kind of connect it together i'm very excited about this trilogy uh thanks for watching it's literally 43 seconds and i talked most of it but if you're here genuinely to hear my thoughts and uh hopes for this game i appreciate it i've had a lot of you guys actually request that we play through hyrule warriors one together um Honestly, I haven't bought the Definitive Edition because I had so many hours on the Wii U one, but I have been tempted to get it since it has all the DLC that I didn't get to play that the Wii U didn't get. I've been really tempted to play it again. So if that's something you'd like to see, uh, let me know. And then obviously there'd probably be some highlights uh, put here on YouTube. And then if you wanted to watch it live or on video on demand, it'd still be on Twitch. I'm not uploading uh, v streams after the fact onto YouTube just because of algorithm stuff, but maybe later on we'll have just a... Maybe later on. We'll see. Uh, anyways, if that's something you'd be interested in, let us know. Cat. <gasps> Hello. I'm going to go, though. Uh, I'm going to get to go to the gym. Thank you so much. Uh, first off, wear your mask. Second off, be safe, my friends. If you like this video, this trailer, or this video that I'm doing right now, I guess give it a thumbs up. If not, give it a thumbs down. Thank you so much for, for talking with me as this game has been teased to come out. Apparently, there's even more details to come out. I hope they're not... I don't think they're giving away too much per tease like this. Um, I just don't want to, like, get too saturated with news. I'd rather just, like, forget about it for... Well, I can't forget about it, but forget about it for a little bit, and then it come out. Does that make sense? 
anyway, I, I'm, I'm excited to talk about it regardless. So thank you to everybody who has been leaving comments. I usually read all of them. Um, so thank you to all the people who have been kind of just getting the, the wheels turning and all our little hamster minds, um, you know, to, to talk about it. So yeah, I'm gonna go. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next one. Stay awesome, stay beautiful, stay savage. And also, um, you're pretty cute. Okay, bye! <laughs> God, Pyrrha's here! Let's go! Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> bye, guys.